I want to be stylish and elegant. I want to look modern. All my friends are looking so stylish and trendy, but not me. I don't know. There's so many trends in the shops. I don't know which one to choose for me. On top of that, I don't want to spend so much money and it will last me just one season. No, I don't want to do that. So in this video, I will try to teach you how to choose the right trend for you, for your personality, for your lifestyle. So stay with me till the end of this video and you won't regret. My name is Ella, I'm a personal stylist and I'm sharing my styling secrets here with you. So back to our trends. I know some of you can be very confused because there's so many trends coming into our life. The season is changing from summer into fall and winter our clothing of course will change as well and there's so many trends that you can get lost plus trends can be very seasonal or can be runway trends which is very difficult to apply to our normal life in this video i'll share six most practical trends you can easily invest into because these trends will really last you for a long time and they will stay with you forever and they will become the part of your basic wardrobe because these trends are very very wearable we can see it on the streets like normal people can use them first of all i want you to understand that trends are made for us that we follow them they're usually very seasonal they don't have long life if they're super super trendy like runway trends for everyday life we analyze them we look at them and we adopt it to our basic wardrobe which we already have actually if you don't maybe it's a good idea to make a new video about it how to create the basic wardrobe this our basic capsule we carry from year to year we just add a little trend into our outfits just to look modern up to date and stylish of course and because I already spoke in my previous video about trendy colors for upcoming 2024 season which if you didn't see please check it out so I will speak in this video about trendy models and of course you can take the trendy colors and add into these models so that will make you look super super stylish so on trend and of course you'll just turn heads the first trend we're gonna talk today about is gonna be corporate business looking suit yes they were presented on the runways by many many big designers such a nice masculine trend which i think every woman should have so many different models of business suits were presented on the runways single-breasted double-breasted uh, uh, tailored oversized shoulders uh, just name it the spirit of the business looking suit was presented on the runways by many designers including valentina which is a very feminine designer but choosing the right suit for you you have of course analyzed your lifestyle your age your body shape the preferences of color of course is there uh, for the fall and winter i would definitely suggest to go for the darker colors like gray shades of gray shades of beige chocolate brown or if you're a black loving person of course go for black my recommendation to you would be just pay attention how you're gonna wear it just think if you want your suit to last for fall and winter with something over it just think what are the colors of your coats of your trench coats how you're gonna make sets with this business suit that will definitely help you to choose the right color if you have your overcoat black color so of course go for gray shades of gray maybe like shades dark shades of green some trendy colors burgundy or if your overcoat is beige classical color you can always use shades of beige this is very very personal and i think a good stylist can always help you to choose the right suit i am wearing one right now and i'm just loving it the most important is to create this business banker look which in my opinion is very sexy especially if you add the right accessories uh, you can play with the colors as well you can add some uh, accent color back accent color shoes and you'll be so on trend and why do i think that the business suit was presented so strongly on the runway because it's really 
it's one of the most basic items you can have because you can use it in so many different variations you can style it with the blouse with the jumper with the turtleneck you can even wear it with the hoodie for the casual day like look for example in this video i'm styling the same business suit but in the five different ways in the five different cities and it's the same suit but absolutely different vibes so you can do the same just use imagination and trust me if you invest in a good business suit you will never regret choosing the right business suit can be very personal because you have to analyze your body shape you have analyzed your age your lifestyle what is your job what do you do in life but i think we all agree that the good business suit is already became a part of our basic wardrobe we all have them in different colors and if you don't have one this is the right time to get but not only suits with the pants we're presenting on the runways if you're a person who loves skirts you can use a skirt and a blazer as well it all depends on you what is your lifestyle if you don't feel comfortable in pants if you prefer skirt go for it just choose the right length i would definitely recommend to have a look at Kors shop because they usually do very big choice of business suits and the finishing is just great they use great fabrics and great great designs of the suit they can be double-breasted single-breasted but uh, Kors usually does uh, their blazers like oversized or straight cut with exaggerated shoulders so if you don't like that pay attention to Massimo Dutti Massimo Dutti does the same great suits as well I personally purchased this year my blazer from Sandro I'm so happy it's a pinstripe I don't know if you can see it on the video but I do love details I love the 100% light wool it holds the shape of the shoulders just perfectly and if you're interested I'll definitely link this suit down below the video so the next trend we're moving to would be very simple simple very easy trend of combination of black and white such a simple but yet elegant trend we know that they were the favorite colors of Chanel and that's why Chanel presented a lot a lot of black and white looks but not only Chanel it was presented by Valentina by Chloe by Armani such an easy trend and so easy to adapt to our life for me personally the trend of black and white represents kind of luxury I would say it's always looks like chic and polished when you're wearing black and white if you use the right accessories with this color combo especially trendy accessories you can add a trendy color bag which we already mentioned in the previous video it can be red bag burgundy bag beige yellow even like any color metallics all these will add some life and will create beautiful elegant so clean so chic look and the most importantly we all have it in our closets we all have our white shirts our black skirts and pants so easy to use trend very easy to use it every single day and very easy to recreate just by adding some nice trendy touches as accessories for example, in this small video, I am showing you how to create simple yet very stylish black and white looks for a casual day. And the next trend we are moving to is going to be necktie. Yes, I'm actually wearing today three trendy things. I'm wearing my business looking blazer, combination of black and white, and I'm wearing my tie. What do I want to say about ties? Actually, Valentina made the whole show on every look the model was wearing a necktie. Uh, Dolce Gabbana as well. So many designers use the neckties this year. So very nice trend, little bit masculine, but I think it's sexy on the same time. And it's very easy to adapt to our life. We just go to our husband closets and take one. My advice on this trend would be don't choose a tie with any prints. Just take one plain color and it will be absolutely fine. And also you don't have to wear it just on the white shirt. You can use any color of your shirt. It can be pink shirt, it can be blue shirt, whatever you wish. Valentino presented collection which every single look had a necktie. Even on the evening looking dresses he used the tie. That may be a little bit too much for me, but 
I can use my tie on any color of the shirt. It can be pink, yellow, blue, any color. It just has to be plain. Don't choose any printed shirt. And the tie, I would recommend also to choose like one plain color. It can have some details like mine, for example, if you can see it has little sparkles that it makes like very, very trendy. But just go to your husband closets and just take one in plain color. Okay, if the first three trends, they were a little bit masculine, they're very like business looking. So the next trend is definitely very, very feminine. The next trend will be exaggerated bows. Yeah, big bows on your blouse, big bows on your dresses. The bigger, the better. So if you have something in your closet, this is the right time to wear it. Many designers presented it on the runways. Uh, Valentino, uh, Valenciaga, if Saint had huge bows and these bows you definitely have to show off I mean it has to stick out and you have to show it off so you can even put a blazer like you can see on if Saint fashion show the bow was over the leather jacket it's a dress with the bow over the leather jacket looks just gorgeous I mean you don't have to look like you're from runway but we know that the bow is on trend so just find your blouse it can be printed it can be one color whatever you've got or whatever you're planning to invest into if you want to invest in this blouse this is the right time and of course if you're in the budget uh, I am sure the shops like Zara Manga will make a lot of blouses with the bows but for for a moment my favorite blouse I found and I already like purchased it for myself that would be Kos it's a beautiful white shirt in the pure 100% cotton with the huge bow on it. I definitely will wear it this winter. And of course, I put here the selection of the other story shop, which is on the budget. You can go for any color, any print. The most important, the focal point in this item is the bow. Just choose the one which is suitable for your style. The next trend which is seen on the runways would be leather. Yes, this is the fabrics which we usually wear during cold period of time, during fall, during winter, and leather always looks so rich and so elegant. I personally have a collection of my leather pants, leather blazers, and I use them for many, many years. It just every year I'm trying to refresh them to put a trendy color blouse with my pants. So you can do the same. The leather was presented on the runways in the many different colors, starting from the trendy burgundy and red color, trendy gray color, from black and white, of course. As I said, the combination of black and white would be great. If you purchase a pair of black leather pants, you can always pull it out with your white shirt. You can use the blouse with the bow as well and you will look just so trendy and so stylish. So the color and the quality of the leather, it's totally up to you because leather can be a little bit costly. So I know the big designers prices is always in thousands of euros, but I would recommend you to have a look at the Massimo Dutti, which is very, very reasonable price exceptional quality i personally buy leather from massimo duty for many years and i use it over and over every year i would just recommend maybe if you really want to be trendy maybe invest in something like beige which is the color of the upcoming season or burgundy or if you really want to invest in something that will last you forever then of course go for black or chocolate brown repeat again when you're buying something very expensive like leather always think how you're gonna wear it think about the colors of your blazers of your coats how you will combine it Black pants, black leather pants, of course, will go with absolutely everything, even with denim. But if you're buying some exotic leather or some uh, colorful leather, so think how you will mix and match with your coats, with your jackets. Think about that. That is very important before you invest into something very expensive. Think about the color of your accessories, the color of your shoes and your bags as well. I'm moving to our last trend, but it's very suitable for people who is living very casual lifestyle, will be total denim look. Yes, of course, it was trendy already this year. Long denim skirts, we see them everywhere, but it's moving to the next year as well. 
Just pay attention here that the denim was presented in many different shades, lighter shades, darker wash, normal regular wash and specifically gray denim will be very very strong for the upcoming season. My personal choice I will go for gray because gray is the trendy color of the season and I'm sure you already have invested in some denim items for this spring 2023 so you can carry these items easily to the next season. And what do I love about denim trend? I think this trend can be easily easily mixed and matched with the previous trends we just spoke about. You can easily choose your favorite pair of jeans and match it with the blouse and the bow. Or you can wear a tie with denim. You can easily put a business looking blazer over your denim jeans and the white t-shirt. All these trends you can add to your jeans so this is so easy and this is the other idea for you how to incorporate trends into your life if you don't have a denim shirt or a denim skirt long skirt or short skirt this is the time to invest and use all these trends for the upcoming season because this trend is so easy to mix and match with all other trends we just spoke about you can use the trendy color of the turtleneck, put it under your denim shirt, and this is already trendy look. You can use your favorite pair of jeans and matching with the blouse and tie bow. Again, we're using two trends. You can put a simple shirt, white shirt, any color of the shirt, and use it with your tie. Again, you're trendy. Or use your business looking blazer with a white t-shirt and your jeans. And you're exactly, exactly like runway models. So I hope this video was useful. I hope you understand that trends don't have to be seasonal, that you can invest into trends which will last you forever. You can carry them for the next year and the years after. And you can mix trends between themselves. You can use this trend and mix it with the other trend. You can use the color trend and mix it with the fashion trend. So thank you for being here with me and please follow me on Instagram. I'm sharing a lot of styling tips. See you soon!